Hello children, Sai Ram. Welcome back to Computer Online class. Children, today we are going to continue our previous chapter that is introduction to notepad. Before we start this chapter, just have an overlook of previous chapter. What we learn? In previous chapter, we learn what uh, about uh, notepad then how to open a notepad and notepad window okay so let's start uh, children in this chapter we are going to learn about editing the text then how to cut copy or paste the text saving a notepad document and opening a document okay okay children our first topic is editing the text children editing editing uh, editing the text means to organize the text or data in a such a way that is become more attractive presentable and easy to read okay editing uh, editing the text uh, means of the text cons uh, uh, consists of the text appearance, changing the alignment, style, font and font color like that. So, children, in editing the text, we are going to learn changing the font style and size of the text. For that, we have to follow the given steps like step number one is move the cursor before heading good manners now select the heading by pressing shift key and right arrow key okay then click the format menu and select the font option we already learned this uh, uh, file menu and the format menu right so Click the format menu and select the font option. Okay. Then the font window will open. Change the font to air from the display the list by clicking on it. Okay. After that, change, change the font style to bold. Okay. And select the font size to 14 from the uh, from the size section and after that last one is click ok and see see the notice the changes of that file ok so let's see practically how do we do this change the font style and size understand children ok children let's see practi practically changing the font style and size ok So, children, move the cursor before the heading good manners. Now, select the heading by pressing shift key. See here, shift key and right arrow key. Okay, like this, both the key have, we, uh, we have to press the simultaneously. Okay, then click the format menu here. And select font option. The font window will open. Change the font to Arial. Here we have to select the Arial from the display list by clicking on it. See, font Arial. Then change the font style to bold. Take a bold and select the font size 14 from size action. See here, take a size 14 and then click OK. Here, see the changes. Understand children? Like this, you have to, you can change the font style, font, uh, font, uh, font size. OK? OK. Our next topic is how to cut, copy or paste the text. OK. So here also are some steps. Uh, should be we have to follow hmm? steps like 
using the shift key and the right arrow key select the line with whatever line we have to select uh, uh, cut or copy na that line we have to select so here we select line uh, talk softly to everyone everyone do not speak harsh this line we have to select with the help of shift key and arrow key okay then click the edit menu and then select cut option place the cursor before always and click the edit menu and select the paste option okay okay children now see practically how we do this uh, cut and copy paste okay okay children let's see practically here using shift key and right arrow key shift key and right arrow key like this then select the line talk softly to everyone do not speak harsh words this line we have to select okay then click edit menu go to edit menu and select the cut option here cut option see line is cut and then place the cursor before before always here place the cursor again click the edit menu edit menu and paste see student that line we cut and we pasted here you understand now how to cut copy or paste okay children now children next topic is saving a notepad document okay here we create a file right we can do the changes editing the uh, text or our document right now this file we have to save in our folder folder okay what is the steps to save the folder so steps is here first one is to save your document click the file menu and select the save option save or save as of then save as box appear okay type a name in the file name box whatever name you have to give na type the name in the file name box okay then click on the save button now your document is saved in a computer okay so let's see practically how to we save the document understand okay student let's see practically uh here to save your document click the file menu and select the save as option okay see save as box appear appear here see and then select and type the file name here see in the file name box here you give the file name here uh, i type the file name is students student okay then click on save button now your document is saved see here your file name is student we save this document after that here it comes students your file name is student okay like this this is the step to save your document in our computer understand children okay children our next topic is opening a document okay now uh, in the last slide we learn how to save the document now student that document how to open that same document how to open for that there is also some steps what is the steps for opening the document first click on the file menu again and select the open option because we have to open the file right then 
the open window appears okay select the desired file from the list means open window is appear and whatever file you have to open na first that file you have to select okay uh, then last is then click on the open button see like this you have to uh, follow the steps to open the document okay so let's see practically how do you open a document in a notepad okay okay children let's see practically how to open a document okay so for opening a document see this is your notepad untitled untitled window first you have to click on file menu then open select your file here your file name is student so select student file see in in the desktop we save this file on in our desktop computer desktop and here see this is your file student click okay select and then click to open a file see here your file is open understand children like this you have to open your document understand children okay children here our introduction of notepad chapter is over now okay children in your textbook there is an activity is given okay please do uh, this activity at your home with the help of your parents whatever we learn in notepad it's the this activity is depend on that all that portion okay so let's do this activity with the help of your parents okay and whenever you get this notes complete your notes okay thank you and once again sai ram